Welcome everyone to this virtual online lecture. My name is Manas uh, and I am here to deliver to you the topic of Unit 3, IT in Action with MIS Application of Information Technology uh, Part A. In this lecture, I will be exploring the ways in which information technology is being used in different uh, industry and sector. I'll also be the discussing the importance of management information system in facilitating with use of technology in this area. Specifically, in this lecture, I will be covering cable TV and video on de demand topic. By the end of this lecture, uh, you will have a solid understanding of cable TV and video on demand, their evolutions and the role of MIS in facilitating this technology. You will also have a uh, better understanding of the potential impact of these technologies on the future of televisions and the entertainment industry. Information technology is an integral part of modern business operations, enabling organizations to streamline their process, increase efficiency, and stay competitive in the global marketplace. Management information system is the use of technology to manage information and provide valuable insight for decision making. Here are some, uh, here are some example of how IT is used in MIS applications. Uh, you can see that uh, here data management, IT is used to capture, store, and process large amount of data, allowing organizations to make better decisions. Tools such as databases, data warehouse, and data mining software are used to manage and analyze data. Another one is um, <laughs> business intelligence. IT is used to extract insights from data and provide valuable information to decision makers. Business intelligence software can generate report data, dashboards, and visualizations to help manager monitor performance, identify trends, and mark informed decisions. Another one is customer relationship management, CIRM. IT is used to manage customer interactions and relationship. CIRM software can help organize decisions, track customer interactions, manage customer account and provide personalized service. And uh, next is the uh, supply chain management, SCM. IT is used to optimize the flow of goods and service across the supply chains. SCM softwares can help organizations manage inventory, track, shipment, and coordinate with the suppliers and distributions. Next is human resource management. IT is used to manage, manage um, employee, employees' information and process HRM softwares can help organizations manage employee record, track, performance, and uh, automated HR processing such as spread all and benefit administration. E-commerce IT is used to facilitate online transactions, enabling electronic commerce. E-commerce software can provide uh, organizations with online stored fonts, payment processing, and order fulfillment capabilities. Uh, in summary, we can say that uh, IT plays a critical role in MIS application, enabling organizations to manage information, extract insights, and make informed decisions from data management to e-commerce. IT is transforming the way business operate and compete in today's digital economy. This is the contents of today's lecture is uh, based on the, I, I just going on through the cable TV and video de demand topic. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, today I will be discussing um, cable TV, 
which is popular from television broadcasting podcasts uh, that has been around us several decades cable tv has revolutionized the way we watch tv and has provided viewers with a wide range of channel and programming options first let's uh, define what cable tv is cable tv is a system of delivering television program to consumers via radio frequency signals transmitted through coaxial cable or fiber optics cable the cable tv systems allow for the transmission of more channel and higher quality signals compared to the traditional broadcast um, television cable tv was first introduced in the 1940 as a way to provide better receptions for broadcast television signal however it was not until the 1970 the cable tv became a popular alternative to broadcast tv particularly in rural areas where broadcast signals were weak cable tv works by transmitting signal from a central location to the series of nodes which then distribute the signal to indu individuals homes or business cable tv provide us typically offer a variety of programming options including news sports movie and specially interested channels some provisions also offer premium channels such as hbo and showtime which require a separate subscription fee impact on television uh, viewerships actually this uh, this cable tv has a has uh, had a significant impact on television viewership prior to the rise of cable tv viewers were limited to the handful of broadcast channels that were available over the yaroy cable tv however offered a viewers access to a wider variety of programming including channels that caters to specific interest and demographics here you can see the there are some uh, advantages and uh, as well as some uh, disadvantages uh, in advantages uh, we can see that uh, wide range of channels there have some wide range of channels which uh, offer a vast range of channels including news sports entertainment and education channels you can choose from a variety of program that cater to your interest high quality signals uh, cable tv provide a high quality signal that ensure a clear picture and sound it is less likely to be uh, affected by weather conditions and uh, than other form of tv such as satellite or digital tv bounding options many cable tv provides offer bundle options where you can get tv in internet and phone service says all in one package which can be cost effective on demand programming uh, cable tv also offer offer on demand programming allowing you to watch your favorite shows and movies at your convenience and there have some disadvantages monthly cost cable tv can be expensive and uh, uh, monthly cost and add up uh, quickly especially if if you uh, want premium channels limited avail availability uh, the, uh, it it is not available in all area particularly in rural or uh, remote locations um, contract obligation some cable tv provider require you to sign a contract which can be a disadvantage if you want to cancel the service before the contact experts technical issues uh, the the tv cable tv can experience technical issues such as cable outage or a signal disruptions which can be uh, frustrating for all of us uh, in summary uh, the cable tv has greatly imp impacted the way we watch televisions by providing a wide range of programming options and high quality signals however it also has its disadvantages such as the monthly cost limited availability contact obligations and technical issues despite this drawbacks cable tv remains a popular from a form of television broadcasting and with the advent of streaming service cable tv providers are now a, now offering more flexible and cost effective options to the consumer next another uh, topic uh, here you see the topic is video on demand 
actually vod is a form of media distributions that allow user to access video content at any time and from any location this means that uh, user can watch their favorite uh, movie tv tv show other video content on their own schedule rather than having to tune in at specific times to watch broadcast televisions this has Uh, several type of VOD service, including subscription-based service such as Netflix, Amazon Prime, Disney Plus, and transactional service such as iTunes and Google Play, and ad-supported service such as YouTube. Each service has its own business model and pricing structure. The work, the workflow for video on demand actually typically involves uh, several, uh, several. Uh, stage including content creations uh, including uh, uh, delivery and um, playback there is a general overview of bod workflow actually that their first is content creation the first stage of bod workflow is uh, involves creating video content such as movies tv shows or other programming content can be created by um, audio uh, by studios productions companies or individuals De depending on the type of content next is encoding once the content is created it needs to be encoded into a digital format that can be streamed over the internet this involvement compressing the video and audio file into a format that can be delivered effect efficiently over the internet different um, different encoding uh, encoding standards uh, are uh, are used to different types of device and network speed delivery after the content is encoded it needs to be delivered to the content delivery network uh, that can serve the content to user the cdn stores the content in multiple server location to ensure ensure quick and efficient delivery to user around the um, world next is playback once the uh, content is delivered user can access it through a streaming platform or application on their device they can browse the available available content and select what they want to watch the video is streamed from cdn to the user device in real time payment and security vod platform typically requires required user to play for access to the content they they want to uh, watch this can be uh, done uh, done through the subscription based model or pay per view options payment is typically processing securely through the platform's payment gateway to protect user financial information anal analytics vod platform often collect data on user viewing behavior and preference to the improvement improve the user experience and make data driving decisions about content acquisitions and promotions the vod workflow may differ um, slight differs slightly depending on the platform and the type of content being delivered but this general overview provided a basic understanding of how how vod works yeah yeah there have also some uh, advantages and disadvantages in advantage sections you can say that convenience one of the most significant advantages of vod is convenience it allow user to watch video content on their uh, on their own schedule and their own pace uh, without having to wait for a schedule broadcast or adhere to the specific programming schedule variety with vod user have to access to a vast library or video content from different uh, location language and region they can uh, choose from a variety of movies tv shows documentaries and other programming options and they is can say the cost effective is uh, vod is often more cost effective than traditional cable or satellite um, tv subscription as uh, user only pay for the content they watch quality um, quality vod offer high quality uh, high quality video and audio streaming making it possible to watch videos in high definition and with clear uh, clear sound and uh, there uh, you also see the disadvantages uh, first one is uh, internet dependence vod uh, relies on internet connectivity to work user must uh, user must have a stable and high high speed internet con connection to stream content 
seamlessly, which can be a challenging in area with limited or slow internet connectivity, and also have some limited access, and there have also subscription cost. Uh, while VOD can be more cost effective than traditional TV subscription, is a may need to pay for multiple streaming services to access all the content they want to watch, which can add up add up to be a more expensive and limited availability of new release. And another one is some technical issues. Video can experience some uh, technical issues such as buffering, streaming delay, and and downtime, which can be frustrating for all of us. And uh, summary, we can say that BOD is a is a convenient and cost effective way for user to access a wide variety of video content on their own schedule. The BOD workflow involves content creating, encoding, delivery, playback, payment, and analytics. While there are many advantages to BOD such as convenience, variety, cost effective, and quality. They are also uh, the several disadvantages such as internet dependency, limited access, subscriptions, uh, or and uh, availability of new release and technical issues. Theory has revolutionized the way we consume video content and is likely to be a, likely to be a continue to grow in popular in future. And overall uh, summary, we can say that IT applications such as MIS. Cable TV and video on demand have revolutionized the way we consume and manage information. MIS help organizations manage their data and make informed decisions. While cable TV offer variety of variety of channels and programming options to viewers. Video on demand allow users to access a vast library of video content on their own schedule, providing convenience and cost effective. Each of these technology has its advantages and disadvantages and their impact on the society and the way to interact with the media with continue to evolve with advantage in technology. Thank you.